Today we are going to review a brand new boat which we think sets some new design and technology standards for fish boats. The team at Beneteau tell us they have built the Barracuda as an all new model line designed specifically for the avid fisherman who doesn't want to compromise comfort, speed or convenience. Let's take a closer look at what they've come up with. The Barracuda is available in several configurations, both single outboard or twin outboard with or without flybridge. She measures in with a length overall with the engines of 28 feet 10 inches, has a beam of 9 feet 9 inches, a draft of 2 feet 7 inches, and can carry 106 US gallons of fuel. She weighs in at 7,053 pounds, carries 26 gallons of fresh water, and is rated for a total maximum horsepower of 400. But as you can see, what makes her unique is her design and layout. In our opinion, this is a new way to go offshore cruising slash fishing. Since most fishermen want to get to their favorite spots quickly, Beneteau has made speed a key requirement of the design of the Barracuda. Initial testing by Beneteau has shown a top speed, with twin outboards, over 40 knots. Beginning our look at the bow, there is a surprising amount of room and notice the height of the cap rail from the deck. In this image, with the sunshade deployed, you have a better sense of scale. All the way forward, we have deep port and starboard anchor and line handling lockers and a modified pulpit-like setup with side rails leading to the windlass mount. There are two teak-covered steps, port and starboard, just aft of the two six-inch cleats. Moving from the bow to the cockpit is easy on either side of the wheelhouse. Notice the handholds on the hardtop and the gunnels. As you enter the cockpit from forward, there is yet another handhold. The height of the overhead in the cockpit is very good, and the design of the modified Bimini is clever. There are options for two different modules behind the wheelhouse. A fold-down seat, as you can see here, or a hanging cabinet with a sink, which can act as a bait station. There are two storage compartments in the cockpit deck. The largest, here in the center, and two smaller to port and starboard. Access to the wheelhouse is from both port and starboard. Space and comfort were key design goals. Note the headroom and the skylight. There are two large bucket seats and a bench seat all the way aft. The helm is clean and has a large center-mounted 10-inch display. The premium wheel is mounted on the horizontal. Looking aft gives us a better sense of how much space there is, as well as the excellent visibility all around. In the sole of the wheelhouse is a maintenance access hatch, and below the aft bench seat, is a refrigerator. To port is your electrical panel with battery switch and fuses. Below deck is a cozy forward berth with room for two and a separate wet head to starboard. The Barracuda is designed with a flybridge, but you can also order it without. The flybridge is accessed via a ladder on the port side. The helm is mounted on a pedestal, provides full instrumentation, and has an area for a seven inch display. There is a comfortable bench seat with room for two. The entire hardtop maintains the overall design aesthetic and forward is a remote searchlight. Viewing her from the bow, you can see traces of a Carolina flare and moving down the side are very high freeboards. The last element is the hull, which utilizes the patented airstep design. Our tests of other Beneteau models with airstep have shown this design increases efficiency and handling characteristics. Look for our full test of this model in the near future. We hope you enjoyed this look at the new Barracuda from Beneteau. For BoatTest.com, I'm Christopher Hughes.